Hey guys, today we will be studying the difference between homogeneous database and heterogeneous database. First, what is homogeneous database and what is heterogeneous database? Homogeneous database is a database which has identical DBMS and uh, it also has identical operating system. Now, in homogeneous database we have single interface while in heterogeneous database we have different types of interfaces. In heterogeneous database we have different types of operating system or uh, we have different types of DBMS softwares also. For example, uh, within a company, uh, if you are in installing a homogeneous database, then uh, we will have uh, same type of operating system running throughout the, all the computers and uh, say for example we have SQL database or Oracle database. So we will have only one database running through all the system. But in heterogeneous database, we will be having uh, all kinds of operating system and uh, it may also have different types of databases as per their need. Now this was the difference between homogeneous and heterogeneous. Now first I will explain you what is the difference between homogeneous and heterogeneous database and uh, lastly we will uh, I will give you some trick how to remember because uh, when we uh, learn the difference between two things we know the difference but uh, while writing on the exam we don't remember all the points so to remember all the points I will be giving you some tricks so let's see first in homogeneous database all sites have same DB product that is database product while in heterogeneous database all sites do not have same database product what does this means means a uh, homogeneous database it may have either SQL or Oracle or uh, either of one but in heterogeneous we can have both so this is all sites have same database here's also important word is database product all sites have same database product while here all sites do not have same database product now installation is easy in homogeneous database because there is only one software to install in all the computers but while in uh, heterogeneous Installation is complex. So here keyword is installation That is I here DB that is D Now administration is easy in homogeneous database while as administration is heterogeneous database is complex So here keyword is administration that is A Now next difference is that homogeneous database provides full data access facility and heterogeneous database do not provide or it provides limited data access facility what does this means homogeneous database we have synchronized data at single place so accessing data is very quite easy there but in heterogeneous database we have different types of databases and uh, it uh, requires some amount of time to synchronize between each database suppose i have updated some data in database one and my friend is accessing that data from another database but it is not yet synchronized so uh, he will not get true data this is the difference so what here keyword is that data access facility data access facility here we have full data access facility while here we have limited data access facility that is D now fifth it provides high performance and here it provides relatively low performance because we have here homogeneous database so performance is quite high so keyword is performance and here there are there needs synchronization and uh, there are lots of things such as translation is also needed be, uh, between the databases so here performance is relatively low now next point uh, so here keyword is p next point is updation updating data is easy in homogeneous database while as in heterogeneous database updating data is complex because because of synchronization only so here updating is keyword now next difference is transaction here transaction is easy to process while in heterogeneous it is difficult to process suppose uh, i am doing the transaction in atm and uh, we have homogeneous system within the bank so if i have done the transaction from my side and uh, uh, by, uh, by some uh, mistake my system get fa uh, failed so this transaction is locked uh, in their database because of the homogeneity so my transaction is not lost but while in heterogeneous database suppose my machine gets failed so uh, as the uh, as it takes times to uh, get synchronization between uh, two different database so my transaction is not logged in their database but my, I have done my transaction so it is a difficult to process transaction 
so most of the banks use easy transaction processing that is homogeneous databases so your keyword is transaction processing t now next difference is communication between two different sites is easy and communication between two different sites require translation now uh, as i said we have two databases such as sql and another is oracle now if we are using homogeneous database so we will have either this one or this one so while communicating from one sql site to another sql site it is easy but while communicating from sql to oracle or vice versa we need translator and now uh, this uh, this is the disadvantages of heterogeneous database so here keyword is communication that is c and last difference is conceptual schema is same and conceptual schema is different so your keyword is conceptual schema now what we have here d for database product same database do not have same database i for installation easy installation complex installation a for administration easy administration complex administration d for data access facility uh, it provides and it it is limited or it does not provides then performance high performance low performance then updation updation is easy updation is complex then uh, seventh is transaction transaction is easy to process here it is difficult to process now next is communication communication is between two sites is easy here it requires translation last is conceptual schema it is same and it is different so what we have here the keywords is d i a d p u t c c so now we know d for database product i for installation a for administration d for data access facility p for performance u for updating t for trans transaction c for communication and c for conceptual schema so we can write this as first we will take u u then we will take pnc pc then we will take last c then we will take t and this d that is td and the and lastly we will take this d i a now here the sentence formed is uh, this is just for uh, remembering all the points your pc contains time division diagram it's pretty easy to remember right your pc contains time division diagram if you remember this sentence whole difference will be available in your mind just remember your pc contains time division diagram your pc contains time division diagram that is updation then uh, p for performance c for communication c for conceptual schema t for transaction then d for database product d for data access facility i for you know installation and a for administration so just remember your pc contains time division diagram and the difference between homogeneous and heterogeneous databases will be by heart to you thank you